The Quest 2 VR headset is a really impressive piece of technology and it can run some really amazing games. And this game is by far the most realistic looking game that we will be able to play on the Quest 2 platform. I can't wait for this game to come out. I'll tell you more information about the game in just a second. Sasha. A floating head. Is that you? It's me, I'm Sasha. Woo. Look at these, oh yeah, reflections, oh. We've received a distress signal from your crewmate on Strelka N3. Look at this dude. You have a new mission. Oh wow. Find him and bring him home. Oh, it's the shine on stuff. Look how Why real this looks. Research facility way I'm out interrupting here. this guy. My reports show nothing. Good. That sector should be deserted. It's beautiful. Whoa! Pause. Pause. Stop. Oh my gosh! Sorry, interrupting. Look at this room. Look at these details. Can I like, get closer? I want to see this in VR. I want to explore this. This looks incredible, absolutely incredible. Wow, look at this plant pot here. This plant has been neglected. Something just doesn't add up. We like the lights. Be careful. Oh, lasers, we like lasers. No, well, graveyard isn't what we were led to believe. Physics, we love physics. <laughs> so, okay, stop. I, I can't control it. This looks cool. Sasha. Sasha? Sasha, where are you? Oh, you shooting. Me? We got guns. Red Matter 2, baby. Woo! Summer 2022. Even better. This is coming out soon. Like, obviously, some of the games from the Quest 2 aren't made to look graphically amazing or realistic, but Red Matter, this is, and Red Matter 2, obviously, is where this game thrives it has really interesting story it's like intense horror type stuff the first one was really kind of freaky when you're going through because stuff just happens and you're like oh didn't expect that to happen talking about nice looking vr games vr wave today's sponsor lets you appreciate those beautiful vr games even more vr wave offers tailor-made vr prescription lenses with a super easy installation on your headset these lenses don't only benefit people who wear glasses they also protect your quest lenses shielding them from scratches and protecting your eyes from blue light these little frames clip around your headset lenses and pop off just as easily they're not permanent they're super discreet and have little magnets on them to connect to the actual VR wave lenses. The facial interface clips on just as it normally would, but setup is easier when you take off the facial interface when putting the clips on. You can then attach the VR wave lenses and you really don't notice them being there. The lens's magnetic design is sleek and offers an easy installation. With worldwide shipping, VR wave is a great accessory to your VR headset if you need it for prescription lenses, want to block out blue light, or just want to protect your Quest lenses from scratches. There is a link in the description to the website if you are interested. You can customize them to your liking quite a bit over there thanks to VR Wave for sponsoring this video. Red Matter 2 will be an adventure game that will be single player. I could read a full paragraph out for you here. Red Matter 2 picks up right where the first game's story concluded. After breaking free from the simulation that held your own mind hostage, your first priority is to escape the Atlantic Union's base. By the way, there's spoilers. I'm reading out spoilers from the first game here. <laughs> I should have said that. During your journey, you will unveil vulgar, vul, vulgar, vulgravia's darkest secrets. Sorry, that's the dyslexia kind of kicking in there. Their darkest secrets and confront the unstoppable red matter. A new tool has been added to the classic loadout that will enable you to hack terminals as well as a projectile weapon. They will prove useful in various environmental puzzles and come well in handy. It'll come well handy uh, when dealing with certain su surprises. The bad guys. Robots. This is Norman from Vertical Robot. He said, we just can't wait for players to feast their eyes on the incredible graphics that we've succeeded in creating. Thanks to our tremendous efforts in optimizing for the Meta Quest 2. Nothing has come close, well, real VR fishing has, but nothing else has come close to the graphical level of Red Matter. And Red Matter 2 is gonna step it up. It's gonna look even crisper, even clearer, and have even more content for us to explore. I'm really excited for this. Let me know if you want more games in the Quest 2 to actually look more graphically realistic, like having all these fancy reflections that I get really crazy over. Most people probably don't, maybe they do. <laughs> maybe I'm just over the top and I'm like, wow, look at these reflections on the glass. Look at that, I can see the light shining off stuff. Whoa, the future and all that stuff. Oh, make sure you check the story posts on the channel, by the way. I have a $100 voucher for the MetaQuest 2 store and the MetaQuest store that I'm gonna give away to one lucky subscriber sometime soon. 
I don't know when, but make sure you have notifications on and don't miss a story post. Check out this video of GTA San Andreas making its way over to the Quest 2. This is a huge game to come across and something I'm so excited about. I cover lots of details in this video, so go look at me, pa my past self in that video, talk about it and rant on about it. Anywho, I will see you in the next video. See you later. Okay, bye.